The following program is rated TV MALSV. It contains strong language, sexual situations, and violence. It is intended only for mature audiences. Yo, there's a lot of haters out there trying to imitate what it is that I do. And I think the imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. But what is a prince to a king but a peasant trying to steal the throne? You do you, and I'll do me. And remember, die slow, bitch. I was born a legend, now can you feel this? I'm about to rock the fucking game like my name was Will Smith. You're trekking up a mountain just to see it. Championship Wrestling presents 25. Jason Dugan versus Jerry Swirls. Center of the ring, Gulfview Mall, Portage, Florida. My name is Sticks, he is Brandon. Jason Dugan representing the brothers in arms in this match. And these two men actually used to be really close friends, almost brothers. Yeah, they used to ride up and down the road together. Shows everywhere they could go. Now, uh, they don't like each other so much anymore. And uh, really, realistically, I have no idea why. I don't think anybody does. I don't think, I think it's a secret between two men who have business to handle. I think that's what this is. Jerry Swirls, the former Atomic Hardcore Champion, 
Jason Dugan also, I believe, held that title. I'm not very versed on the uh, the history of Atomic, but uh, who cares? We're here live at Generation Championship Wrestling at the Gulf View Mall in where sticks? Yeah, Port Ritchie, Florida. Lifts him off. Swirls goes for a back elbow, misses with a second one. Oh, I'm in the mush. That was not just an ordinary slap. There, that was almost personal. Yeah, well, no. We said they've got some personal issues here. Swirls throwing, miss. Dugan throws a line, misses. Gets caught with a booty bump. I think Jerry Swirls calls that the back door or the rear view. I'm not entirely sure, but a splash into the corner. And a bulldog. Really not sure why he would put that over, but here we go. Cover. Rev Julie makes a count. Kick out at one. Brothers in arms on the outside. Swirls off the ropes. Gets caught. Oh, wait. He tripped over his shoelace. And look at Julie being a fantastic referee, noticing the distraction right off the rip. Oh, my God. The camera. There we go. Dugan Eaton throwing hands. Swirls eating some fists. Don't mess up the curls, buddy. Jerry Swirls has a Jerry curl, and you definitely don't want to mess it up with those fists. Kick to the face. That is a beautiful face. Why would anybody? Well, speaking of faces. The money maker. Swirls getting chunked on the second rope as the brothers in arms are backed away by the ever-present Ref Julie. Again, the official doing a fantastic job, keeping it unbiased down the middle. Swirls on the outside, eating the tile. Brothers in arms creeping over. Dugan holding the high ground. What a show we've got here. Generation Championship Wrestling presents 25. Make sure you like, follow, and subscribe on all social media platforms. Now, Swirls has till the count of 10 to answer the ref's call. However, I would try to get in there as soon as possible, and he does. And Dugan again on the offensive. Laying the boots. Straight to the midsection of Jerry Swirls. Ooh, grabs him by the hair. Again with the curls, not nice. Gonna tangle it up, nice. Headlock take over there. Drops the knee. Nice lateral press with a hook in the leg, but not enough to put down Jerry Swirls. Kicks out of two, and Dugan right immediately into a rear chin lock. Almost a fisherman hook chin lock there, the way that he's got his arm set here. Swirls trying to reach the ropes. Ladies and gentlemen, I know you think this is a simple hold, not very effective, but if you drive the air out of your opponent's lungs and cut off the blood flow to the brain, he's not going to be able to fight very much longer. Swirls trying to create some separation and gets caught with a low kick right to the knee. And a Ooh. face kick. Holy cow. I was Cover. I was going to say, when you take the wheels from underneath the car, it can't drive, and that's exactly what happened with Jerry Swirls right there. Dugan with some great offense in this match. Probably one of the best I've seen in quite a while from this man. I've watched him all up and down the coast. I mean, we've seen his career for years now. You've seen the progression of one Jason Dugan and Jerry Swirls almost simultaneously. Their careers very much a very parallel. And with uh, Dugan now has found some aggression as he throws uppercuts and fists to the face of Jerry Swirls. He's found some aggression. He's turned up the volume on his career. And I got to say, I kind of like it. That's why I said earlier on in this match, these two men used to be like brothers. And what do you do when you're in a match with somebody you have so much chemistry with that you've been up and down the road with, that you know a lot about, that you've studied, that you've seen, that you've tagged with? What do you do? You beat the hell out of him. And Swirl's trying to return the favor with some chops here. Might want to take off that vest. They might be a little bit more effective. Ref Jewel using that five count to get a clean break out of the corner. Oh. Double feet to the face. Jerry Swirls might be on Dream Street. Jason Dugan doing everything he can to maintain the momentum in this match. Oh, go for a nice key lock there. Almost an Americana Jiu-Jitsu lock there. Jerry Swirls in a bad, bad way as his shoulder is being ripped out of joint. Jason Dugan, the kind of wrestler who is not only very athletic, but he's multifaceted when it comes to his wrestling styles. He can go to the top rope, he can be a technician, he can be a submission expert as he's showing here with the chin locks and the wrist locks and the and the face ripping. Well, oh, the face gouging too. Nobody said the man was perfect. You haven't you had your nose almost ripped off your face? No, but I know a few people who have. That's a whole other story for another time. Six. Six. A lot. Jerry Swirls trying to count his teeth. Cover. Oh, nope, not quite. 
Jason Dugan sliding out here. Gonna use the post. Ooh. Oh no, not the GCW sign. Kick to the face. Gomez is gonna get mad. I know he's somewhere. He's lurking, he's watching. You know if there's a GCW show, that means Mr. Gomez oh is in the building. Oh no, your arm is not supposed to bend that way, ladies and gentlemen. Exactly as I've said before, Jason Dugan, oh knowing how to pick apart the limbs of his opponents, doesn't matter if it's the wrist, the elbow, the shoulder, the knees, That's the ankles. Of the, the arm joints being ripped at the same time. Oh my God, and the phalanges. Oh my God, that hurts so bad. The metacarpals of the hand not feeling too well right now. Jerry Swirls writhing in pain. And Jason Dugan just putting some stank on it, man. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's not always the big joints. It's not always the big ones that hurt the most. It's the little ones. It's when you get when you stub your toe in the middle of the night and somebody's ripping your hand off of your wrist. A wise woman once told me it's the little things that matter. <laughs> she lied to you. Hey, wait a minute. She lied to you. Jason Dugan on the outside. Looks like he's going to try and get some frequent flyer miles here. Told you. Climb into the top, trying to showcase his range as a professional wrestler rolls through. Nice agility, gets caught with a boot to the face. Jerry Swirls trying to power up here. Jerry Swirls is no slouch either. He instinctively knew he was out of the way, again, because they know each other so well. Oh, I'm gonna show off those moves. Shucking and jiving, tilting and whirling. Looks like a blender that's about to die. Good Lord, that is not what it... I haven't seen that much meat since the turkey at Thanksgiving last year. Yo, cover. Swirls trying to get the win. Not quite. Two and 15 sixteenths. Look at Sticks, knowing his fractions. I, look, I know numbers. I know numbers. Not all the time. You know. Swirls now trying to build some momentum. Here come the brothers in arms. Gonna show the numbers, gonna take control. Nice clothesline there. Swirls getting beat down for showing up here at the Gulfview Mall. And a solid DDT. Cover. Two, three. Jason Dugan takes home the W for the brothers in arms here at GCW XXV. Jason Dugan shows up and finds a way to win the numbers. Included the brothers in arms doing what they do best, walking away with a victory by any means necessary. Ladies and gentlemen,